Hello everybody, Code Theorem here, and I'm going to continue showing you how to use Raid Theorem. In fact, today we're going to go over the settings menu in the um, in Raid Theorem's website on the dashboard. So let's press this big blue button that reads Settings. It'll load real quick, and then we'll see quite a few things that might not exactly add up and make sense right away. First thing you'll notice is this Extend Subscription. If you don't already have a subscription, it'll say something slightly different, but it'll get the point across. Um, and here's where you can purchase and pay for your Raid Theorem subscription. You need a Raid Theorem subscription in order to access any of your own servers and games and stats and commands. You must make sure to have your subscription paid for. Um, it will tell you if you do currently have a subscription when your subscription ends so make sure to keep your eye on that and uh, don't let it go out then you have connect raid theorem to your roblox account now in my how to um, think it's how to set up raid theorem or something along those lines I do have a video on how to verify your account how to or why pain is good and all the things involved in setting up an account with Raid Theorem and one of those is connecting your Raid Theorem uh, to your Roblox account. I've gone over that. Here it hopefully if you are verified it will say you're already verified down here. If it doesn't say that make sure you go back and you find my video on how to sign up how to set up Raid Theorem. Over here is refer a friend. If you refer a friend to sign up for Raid Theorem and they end up purchasing the product or end up purchasing this product then you will get an extra free week added to your subscription that is completely and utterly true if you refer a friend they sign up from your referral link they have to sign up from your referral link or this isn't true if, and they sign up from your referral link and then later on they buy it even for just like a month um, you get an entire week added on for free that's a substantial amount and that's for every referral you get it's not just a one-time thing where you get a referral once no it's every time you refer somebody um, when they first purchase Raid Theorem then you get um, you get an extra week if this only applies if you currently have an active subscription if your subscription is not active at the time that they purchase it you do not get your extra week so make sure you're subscribed when you you know refer people down here is the main topic of the day others on your dashboard and adding someone to your dashboard what does this mean what does it do so down here there's a brief description it reads adding someone to your dashboard allows them to see all the stats from your games and send commands to your servers Again, this only applies if your account has a currently active subscription when they are looking um, and going to their own dashboards. They can only see your servers, your stats, send commands to your servers if and only if you have a currently active subscription at that time. Um, you can remove people from your dashboard at any time with the list to the left. So what this means is if you're paying for um, Raid Theorem, you, when you click on servers you can see all of the servers that have ever existed since you put Raid Theorem into your game the Raid Theorem model that is and you've set up HTTP service and you've done all the stuff to set Raid Theorem up in your game once you've done that the servers button um, will show up all of the servers that have been made since then now if you add somebody to your dashboard they see all of your servers all of your games everything that you see too. Now, there should be a little asterisk when I say everything that you see. Um, because if you're added to other people's dashboards, but somebody that's added to your dashboard isn't added to the same person's dashboard that you've been added to, they don't see that. You, to simplify things, when you add somebody to your dashboard, they only see your stuff. They don't see the stuff that you've been added to. Okay? Hopefully, hopefully that's not too confusing. Um, so you just put in their email address here, same as the referral, and you press invite to dashboard. That will add them to your dashboard over here, and it will email them that, hey, you've been added to this person's dashboard, go check it out, um, and they'll be notified. 
You can remove people from your dashboard. I'm not going to remove Tanner right now because he's a pretty good friend of mine and I like having them on here. Um, but you can remove from dashboard uh, just by clicking this button and they'll be gone and they can't see or do anything to your servers ever again. All right. So hopefully this has been a brief enough but um, explanatory enough video on how to use the settings screen on your RAID Theorem dashboard. This has been Code Theorem. Um, I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. If you have, don't forget to hit the subscri subscribe button. Please hit the like button and leave a comment below. I read as many of them as I can and I respond to any that are warranting a response. And also I can reply to you with this new Roblo or YouTube settings. There are some comments that... You say, hey, could you respond, but I can't reply because your settings are too strict for me to do that. Um, so make sure if, you need, if you're asking for me to reply, make sure that your settings allow me to reply to your comment. Um, so comment below, like the video, and make sure to hit the subscribe button. I will catch you guys later.